What's up guys, this is Cody here. And today I'm gonna to be showing you how to jailbreak iOS 8.4 using the newest version of Taiji. Now, there's gonna be a few things that you wanna keep in mind before you actually start this process. One is that I had to downgrade iTunes. So some people are reporting that it's working on the newest version of iTunes for them, but obviously it's not working for the newest version of iTunes for everybody. So I think if you do downgrade, it's probably going to work 100% of the time. Otherwise, you can always try it with the newest version of iTunes, and if it doesn't work, then downgrade iTunes and then try again. Now, keep in mind, this is only going to work on Windows, but if you guys want to see how to jailbreak iOS 8.4 on a Mac, then be sure to hit that like button, and I'll do a tutorial on it. So if you guys don't know how to downgrade iTunes, I'll put a link in the description below. I just recently did a video on it. It can be a little bit finicky, so you definitely want to watch the video if you don't know what you're doing. The next thing is that you are probably already jailbroken on iOS 8.3. So I'll go ahead and list off what you want to do to basically re-jailbreak your device on iOS 8.4. So the first thing that you want to do is just plug in your device to your PC. The next thing you want to do is back up everything on your device. That way, in case anything goes wrong during the jailbreak, you're going to have that data on your computer. Now, after you're done backing up your device, you want to put your device into DFU mode. So if you don't know how to do or go into DFU mode, then just look it up on YouTube. I might have actually a video, and if I do, I'll put a link in the description below for you guys to just click on. It's really simple. But put your device into DFU mode, and then you're going to restore your iPhone. So if you just click on Restore iPhone, then basically what it's going to do is download iOS 8.4 and install 8.4 on your device. And basically it's going to be a fresh restore. So you're not going to have anything on your device and you're going to be on 8.4. So you can obviously see that I'm on 8.4 because I have this music icon right here, which is new to 8.4 because Apple Music was released. And that's why you actually want to upgrade to 8.4 to jailbreak rather than staying on 8.3. So I know that was a bit of a mouthful, but it's crucial that you know what you're doing and you have all these steps in mind and you don't, you know, you don't want to mess this up because it can be extremely frustrating because I myself hate doing this over and over. So I know you guys do too. So the next thing that you want to do is just make sure that you have all the same stuff that I mentioned in my previous jailbreak video, like turning off your passcode, also turning off, find my iPhone. And for me, I like to turn on auto lock to never. So it's not going to lock the device automatically at any point during this process. The next thing that I do is just throw your device into airplane mode, as you can see right here. So my device is on airplane mode. So at this point, now all we want to do is just download the Taiji jailbreak tool, which of course I'll put a link in the description below for you guys. And if it's downloading really slow, then I'll put a mirror up for you as well. But you can see right here, we're just gonna double click on this. And when we open this up, we shouldn't have any issues whatsoever. You can see that it's saying iOS 8.4. So it has been updated and it's recognized my six plus right here. So now of course right here, all we wanna do is untick the 3K because we don't want that third party software. We do want Cydia. So now what we wanna do is just click start. Now for any reason you do get stuck at 20%, 40%, or 60%, make sure you do all of those steps that I mentioned, especially downgrading your iTunes. Now I downgraded my iTunes to 12.0.1, so just keep that in mind. Again, there's gonna be a link down in the description to show you exactly how to do that. All right, so you can see that we have jailbroken completely. And now when we swipe over here, you'll notice that we have Cydia installed. So if we tap on that, of course, it's going to prepare the file system and make sure that you get out of airplane mode before you actually prepare the file system. All right, so we've prepared the file system and we have rebooted the device. And you can see when we open up Cydia here that it's going to load right up. So that's all you have to do in order to jailbreak on iOS 8.4. Make sure that you follow those steps pretty carefully just in case you are having any issues whatsoever. Now, of course, if you guys want to see how to jailbreak iOS 8.4 on a Mac, make sure you hit that like button and I'll be sure to do a video on that. All right, guys, as always, if you enjoyed this video, make sure you smash that like button. If you guys want to see more of my videos, then go ahead and subscribe. All right, until next time, peace.